these two are locking their wings. There's one out there and all. Which ones do I concentrate? Oh, I've got up the duty. Eh? He's gone. David has moved down the valley now onto a low-lying flat field. Before setting up, he walks the feeding birds off the field. He's using a traditional basic horseshoe pattern of flocked shells. The net hide is positioned in front of a hedge with some rape stems and grass pushed into the hide for extra camouflage. With a brisk wind now developing, David watches the pigeon's reaction to his pattern very carefully. The flight line seems to have shifted up to the far side of the field where one or two birds are dropping in to feed. Two birds turn from the far side, flying low over the field to his decoy pattern. Let's head up to the trees, but others continue to feed at the far end of the field. But a single bird takes the decision, turns and heads to the decoys on a long, slow approach. The shot has put a large flock of birds off the field and indeed out of the surrounding trees. In many circumstances it's surprising how many birds have actually accumulated and it's often worth putting a shot up just to disturb them, particularly if they're not coming back to the decoy pattern. A steady flow of birds starts to return to the field with the decoy standing out well. With the light low, the birds head for the head of the pattern in a steady line. <laughs> 